if you are facing the problem intel hxm not install then first go to the command prompt and open and type here system info dot exe and find here virtualization enable in firmware if we find no then restart your pc and open the bios and go to the advanced tab and intel virtualization technology here is disable and make this enable in other case this may be vtx and now save and exit now follow and open the command prompt and type the same system info dot exe and find the and now check here hyper b requirement virtualization enable firmware and now this is yes and make exit exit the command prompt this mean that your vtx is enabled and now open control control panel and program and feature turn windows feature on and off and scroll the mouse and search here virtual machine platform click here and windows hypervisor platform and now click ok and restart now restart your system and now open the android studio and click on sdk manager click here sdk tools and select here intel x86 emulator hxm installer but this is deprecated so if you want to install hxm click here and download from other sites click here for download and hxm windows version click here and download but the latest latest version of android studio we don't need to hxm install but if you want to install the hxm you can follow the this way because hxm is deprecated and now install hxm if you need extract out file and click on hxm setup but latest version of android studio you don't need to hxm if you enable 
हाइपरवाइजर वर्चुअलाइजेशन नाउ ओपन द एंड्रॉइड स्टूडियो एंड रन द इम्यूलेटर एंड वेट सम टाइम वेट अ मिनिट एंड हेयर इज कनेक्टिंग टू द इम्यूलेटर so our emulator is working and in this way you can solve your hxm problem and now test it will take a little time so our app is installed successfully and our emulator is working fine and now read this documentation if you have the amd machine in this case you should enabled amd b or svm and in case of intel processor enable vtx Thank you for watching this video.